For years, Wabur has spent his days diving and exploring the oceans. Sea stars in particular are his passion. When I use this time-lapse movie, then all of a sudden you take picture, 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 picture. And when you're projected, they go very fast and I can finally see a sequence. So I said, my God, this is what they're doing, you know, and this is how they behave. And they look beautiful when they run at the fast speed. Time-lapse photography allowed Wabur to witness the vibrant lives of echinoderms for the first time. He found that they interacted with each other just as other animals do. They just do it in a different time frame. When Wabur began to analyze their behavior, he was shocked to discover that the sea stars were actually fighting for dominance. Not only do they fight for dominance, they do it through ritualized wrestling bouts. Jockeying for position, the combatants try to get the upper hand. Eventually, they will lock arms, each trying to pin its opponent. Wabur believes that the sea star that manages to come out on top will enjoy a dominant position until the wrestlers meet again. When fights occur over food, he found that the animal first on the prize usually wins. Apparently, even among sea stars, possession is nine-tenths of the law. <laughs> <laughs> 